To prevent drug trafficking, the Anti-Drug Committee of the Ministry of Interior will strengthen police forces at the subnational level by adding two to three more officers in villages, communes and districts, especially in line with the government's anti-drug plan. Kao Kandara, chairman of the Anti-Drug Committee, said yesterday at a meeting on the committee's initiative that the drug problem in Cambodia has worsened. He added that the amount of drug-related offenses authorities have cracked down on is increasing every year and there is more large-scale production of drugs, with methamphetamine the most widely produced narcotic. Before 2015, he said, Cambodia was the least drug-affected country in the region, however, with the number of drug offenses increasing and more people being treated for drug abuse, the kingdom has a drug problem similar to other countries. There are some sub-national officials who still consider the fight against drugs a job for national-level authorities as local efforts to combat drugs are seen as ineffective and haven't gained the confidence of the public. He also requested that units under the Ministry of Interior, General Secretariat, General Commission of National Police, and General Departments appoint at least two to three police officers to facilitate and be in charge of the fight against drugs. Deputy Secretary General of the National Authority for Combating Drugs Lt. Gen. Niku Thea said yesterday that confiscating chemicals used in illegal drug production was vital in stopping the problem. He added that over the years, organized crime has attempted to use Cambodia as a processing hub and transit point for illegal drugs, so provincial authorities in border provinces have to strengthen measures to prevent the trafficking of drugs in and out of the country.